This will be your official Nightmare Mangle plus. Hey everybody, Crew here. Today I'm gonna do a DIY on um, Nightmare Mangle. So first you need um, a Mangle plush. I just got a bootleg. Um, I got three of them. But today we're just gonna do Nightmare Mangle. So first, the materials you need are just this. Yes. You just need one black Sharpie, so um, I'm gonna, so the first thing you need to do is you're gonna um, put um, a, some holes on her stomach. So do that right now. I'll see you Done after with you're done. making the holes. Um, we'll um, dry it off after. But as you're going to wait to it to dry, we're gonna put some other holes on the mouth, aka the cheeks right here. So you want a red marker for the step. Let me just get this. Yes, I have two sharpies. <laughs> I don't know why. So you want um to make um, red um cheeks from right here to right there. So I'll so when you're done with that, pa unpause the video and let's keep on going. Yes, I kind of smudged it, but that's okay because, n like, whoever sees the side of Mangle's cheek, like, you can just swipe it or whatever. But for the next step, um, I want you to um, just it's it's just gonna be a quick thing. We're just gonna I just want to do this. If you don't um, you don't have to. You need a black sharpie again and just color in the white spot in the eye. If you don't, that is okay. Just because I don't, I don't, it just seems fitting for a nightmare. But if you don't, you can hear my dad whistling and also my dog right there. So <laughs> just get a black sharpie. If you want to just color in that spot. So if you're done, just same thing. Unpause the video and we'll keep on. And um, I just put a, a hole right here um, through the cheek if you want to. You have to put some holes through the ears. So you just put like like one or two on each on this ear. You can leave this ear with some too. Um, so the thing you just need here is just a black Sharpie and that would be it. So just um, color it and then we're going to move on. So hope you're doing good so far on this because it's my first you DIY. Two other olden holes in the ears. That is completely optional. Well, but next, um, this is another one of your choices, like the eye. Um, you can make claws if you want. I don't know why. Just since the nightmares have all these claws, you can just um, again, you just do um a um black sharpie and just t create. Two triangles for each side. Of course, I'm gonna do it, my boys. So, um, or gals. So, um, see you guys in the next step, <laughs> or the next video. We're gonna say that at the end. So let's do it. Okay. So when you're done doing the claws, AK, this is completely optional. It's okay if you mess up. It's okay. I'm not. I'm not judging you. Um, we're not going to the back yet because we still have to do the legs. So, again, um, you you just um, put some holes in the legs. And it should be looking about like this so far. So, um, let's get... So, just put some holes on if you want on the feet or on the legs. I'm going to probably going to do it on the feet because the legs don't be seen a lot. So... Let's so do it. when you're done, I'm um, putting your holes in your feet or the legs. Disclaimer: I know this is her endoskeleton. I'm just saying that. I'm just saying that. But if you didn't know, the toy Foxy from the first wave has the same feet. So this counts kind of as. Um, her feet. So, just for the next step, <laughs> we're just moving on. Um, you're, we're going to move on to the back. So, you can put um, at least three holes on the head. Three or two holes on the head. So, um, just again, just a black sharpie. And if you want, I'm just saying, if you want. Um, you can have a gray Sharpie if you do, 
and color a, a, like something like um a endoskeleton. Um, I don't have any examples. I do have um this guy with the, like that, something like that. So something like that on the head, just for some textures. Of course, I don't want to do it because that would probably mess up the whole entire thing. So if you want, get gray or black to just create some holes with an endoskeleton. As you can see, you would have to just easily put some holes on the um, back. And that would, I want, wait, wait, if you want to, just saying, you could put holes on the snout. I'm of course, probably am, so. Just, just because I forgot about it, you can just um put some holes on right here and put a like one hole on there. So, see you guys until you're done. Um, I I added um a hole on the snout and on the top of the head just for texture. But when you're done with the hole, just for a disclaimer. A disc, uh, you can pause the video right here because we're going to be working on the bottom. Let me just take this piece of yarn off. I will probably have to cut that off, but who cares? Um, this is just for the people who want a fully nightmare mangle. So, you would have to put it right here where the butt is. And just put one hole there. Just one. Nothing else the butt um you can also take off the tag and again here is the snout you have completed your nightmare mangle um you can let it dry i'm just going to test out something because i just want to see because yeah you can leave it drying like that just because i want um you guys to not ruin the um structure you're on hope you didn't get in trouble with that by the way so yep you can just leave it up standing and you're officially done with your nightmare mangle i will be posting probably a video tonight so stay tuned but this is my diy on the nightmare mangle